what's up folks carolina cat daddy Woo! we got the covid we're over it now we're over the covid now we've been uh haven't had a fever in five days uh, feeling great everything been researching we're good to go junior hit me up wants to go fishing so i'm gonna go fishing just went to jamie k's and got some bait uh we need a new net our net's trash we do got another net but uh we're not throwing them net tonight we went bought bait got three dozen shad uh, me and Junior's been fishing a lot lately. Y'all been in this funk. I kind of tell y'all about it. I told y'all about it. Been in a funk. And uh, haven't been recording like I should have been. Me and Junior had some good trips. My goodness, the first trip of this little spree we had, we probably fished five, six times. And uh, the first time we went, I didn't bring the camera. And we caught two thirty eights and a 30, two thirty one been tagging a lot of fish too i got some clips after this trip i think i got a we took some pictures off his phone screenshots of some videos and it wasn't that great but i'll, I'll put up some pictures So we went back and we've been fishing like crazy. Um, I'm just gonna go through some of the trips. I'm just gonna go ahead and go through them. Hold on, I'll net them. What's good, Blue? I can set them too. <laughs> That's a good one, bro. You done? That ain't bad. Dude, I swear I seen that rod bounce. Bring over here. Let me see that jaw. That fish's jaw. Straight broke. Broken half. Good fish, though. What you got to say, Junior? No. <laughs> Yo, you ain't got nothing to say now. I stole your fish. <laughs> Island boy. Man, they swing way up for. Yeah, bigger than the last one I caught. They ain't saying much. Yeah, I know. He ain't notable. He ain't no island boy. Little guy, man. Pretty does. shot in front of people to begin with but it's just these last ever since i blew my boat motor y'all it just it deflated me y'all like it took every bit of energy out of my sails i had wind out of my sails whatever you want to call it. it it completely took me down and i'm starting to try and get back into it i was starting to get uh more motivated i went to santee for a few days come back was fishing wiley and then covid hit me and it kind of just put me back down but we're gonna work on it. I'm gonna try and make this uh gonna try to be more positive about my channel too. That's why I'm kinda of weary of telling y'all that I've been in this slump. I don't wanna put my bad energy on y'all. Because it works like that. It's crazy how energy works, but I want nothing but good vibes and you know I'm gonna try and uh get past this slump I'm in. I'm not gonna let it affect y'all. I thank y'all so much for watching the channel. It's been a rough couple months here. We still got a good bit of footage, but like I said, I've been going trips and I just ain't been narrating. And uh, like I said, it all leads back to the boat. That that really that really hurt my morale. But uh, Dad's got it. We got my motor broke down. We got the parts ordered. You know, he works a full time job too. So I'm hoping the earliest another month, maybe two months, we'll have my boat back on the water. I've been taking my boat out and fishing with just a trolling motor, but that kind of deflates me a little bit too you know like i really there's something about riding on a boat like full blast just riding 
I, I cannot, there is nothing in this world that will ever be able to replicate that for me. That feeling, there's, if you've never done it, maybe it don't do it for you, but for me, that is probably the best feeling in the world. It's just wide open on the water, just going, I can't. That's the most therapeutic thing I've ever experienced in my life. And I really miss that. You know, it was a struggle for me to even get back to where I could have a boat on the water and for it to be taken back away that quick, you know. But there's things in my life I gotta clean up. I know that. So, we're working on that too. Uh, we got t-shirts getting printed right now. I'm gonna go ahead, I hope we have a good night of fishing tonight. If we have a good night of fishing tonight, this video will be the next video y'all see. And uh, we're gonna go give it a try. We got some shirts printed, um, got some white and black ones, a couple two X's, a couple mediums, a couple larges, and a whole bunch of extra larges. Um, if you're interested, we'll, we'll see about how we're gonna work this out. Trying to get this thing going. I have a whole nother t-shirt business that I want to get going. I almost bought a, uh, a company. I didn't, I don't know, it might still happen. It was, it was, the people that own the company actually come to me and ask me about it. And I was interested, but I don't know, it's kind of scary. It's a good bit of a little chunk of change to put up. And now they're trying to make it work again. So I don't know how that's going to work out. But we definitely got a whole company we're wanting to start with t-shirts. And not just my YouTube shirt. I'm talking about a whole different line of shirts. But uh, I'm going to go get changed some clothes. And we're going to head to Lake Wiley. Y'all stay tuned. That was a good one. He, he can drag. Hey, this rod just slammed too, dude. Did it really? I promise you. Right before you turn the camera on. Keep on it. Got the anchor rope right here. Like, oh, oh yeah, you got it on this side. He's on anchor right now. Oh, that's a good one, Julie. Hell yeah. Put it there. Oh, that's a good one, boy. Woo! Think that's the one with I don't up? think so. I think the other one's bigger. Damn, it's a pretty color. Cat and shad, too, baby. Laser dish. Put it there again. <laughs> Seven, thirty-eight, thirty-nine. Come on, baby. It hit thirty-nine one time. Let me do it. I want you back over. Thirty-seven, thirty-seven, ten. Damn, it looks bigger than that, don't it? Yeah. I'm gonna buy a set of them crane set of scales. I need to put the batteries in there. This one's hitting 39. That's my tournament scales you got. It hit 39. So it's 38 pounds? We'll say 38. Because the
Yeah, it looks bigger like that. Yeah. Like Wiley Flathead. Put him back in the water. He's got a hook in his, he swallowed a hook. Did he? Yep. I can't get it out, I don't see it. Cut the line off of him. Let's go feel for him, let's go find it. <laughs> <laughs> we got a hook, we need to go find it. He's your daddy. Go ahead and stick your finger in his butt. It is right there. It swallowed a hook. And we cut the line. We're going to. He'll be all right. He'll get it out of there. Hey, you got chicken first. <laughs> Just a pinky. We'll see if we got. We'll see if they're eating shells. They might have an acorn in there. You know. <laughs> Alright y'all, that's the end of the video. Me and uh we out here fishing in the snow, y'all. We got some snow in South Carolina. <laughs>